Shalom and greetings my friends. Welcome to the faith I live by. Today's scripture reading is taken from 2 Timothy chapter 3 verse 16. It reads, All scripture is God breath and is used for teaching, rebuking, correcting and training in righteousness. My friends, the word of God includes the scriptures of the Old Testament as well as of the New. One is not complete without the other. The Old Testament, no less than the New, should receive attention. As we study the Old Testament, we shall find living springs bubbling up where the callous reader discerns only a desert. There is no discord between the Old Testament and the New. In the Old Testament, we find the gospel of a coming Savior. In the New Testament, we have the gospel of a Savior revealed as the prophecies had foretold. While the Old Testament is constantly pointing forward to the true offering, the New Testament shows that the Savior prefigured by the typical offerings has come. The dim glory of the Jewish age has been succeeded by the brighter clearer glory of the Christian age. Christ as manifested to the patriarchs, as symbolized in the sacrificial service, as portrayed in the law and as revealed by the prophets is the riches of the Old Testament. Christ in his life, his death and his resurrection, Christ as he is manifested by the Holy Spirit is the treasure of the New Testament. Our Saviour, the outshining of the Father's glory is both the Old and the New Testament. The Old Testament sheds light upon the New and the New upon the Old. Each is a revelation of the glory of God in Christ. Both present truths that will continually reveal new depths of meaning to the earnest seeker. Jesus said of the Old Testament scriptures, and how much more it is true of the new. They are they which testify of me. John 5 verse 39. Yes, the whole Bible tells of Christ. From the first record of creation, for without him was not anything made that was made. John 1 verse 3. To the closing promise, behold, I come quickly. Revelation 22 12. We are reading of his works and listening to his voice. If you would become acquainted with the Savior, study the Holy Scriptures. Friends, I am inviting you to accept the Word of God and choose to walk with Him. For this is the faith I live by. Mm -hmm.